ABC 13 Eyewitness News reporter Pooja Lodia's dress blows up on a live shot. Reporter Katie takes a tumble during her live TV segment. She didn't suffer any injuries, and most impressively, she finished her hit. Our drive times now, folks coming in from Carmel. If you're using US 31 southbound, your average speed is 43. The Lion wants news reporter Haley Winslow for lunch. Cold as much as the tires, do you? But he's choosing to be outside, and if it gets really cold, he can go into his den in the back. Right, Tao? <laughs> Helen Skelton live on BBC One, presenting Our Greatest Team, Athletes Parade Live. Suffers wardrobe malfunction after a gust of wind blows her skirt off, revealing she isn't wearing any underwear. Reporters and animals don't go together, but they do produce hilarious outtakes. A reporter in Virginia, doing a stand-up at a farm, gets a little love from one of the animals. This is Tara Morgan, and that camel over her shoulder apparently finds her irresistible, as he sniffs, then takes a big mouthful of hair. All is well, though, the reporter wasn't hurt. Oh, no! Get it out! <laughs> a woman interrupts a live TV broadcast when she said, fuck me right in the pussy right after some guys yelled, fuck her right in the pussy from their car. Big news day ever. LMFAO. Confined is now... <laughs> Sorry about that. Is now taking the first place position on why our teens are experiencing... Fuck me right in the pussy. Sorry. <laughs> okay, go ahead. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> when a boy at the Portland Rose Festival blurted out, I like turtles, during a KGW TV live shot. No one imagined what a viral sensation it would become. Live at the Waterfront Village with my friend, the zombie, Jonathan. You're looking good. Jonathan just got an awesome face paint job. What do you think? I like turtles. All right, you're great zombie. Good times here at the Waterfront Village. ABC Action News reporter Serena Fazan was live on air when a masked man interrupted her live shot. Far from here. Okay, thank you, sir. The reporter is reporting live about a train derailment when a man runs up and grabs her microphone and yells, fuck her right in the pussy. It's not very, very unusual. The three victims were part of a CXS. Fuck her right in the pussy. We have all seen the BBC interview where the babies walked in. But what if it happened to the mother? Children's just walked in, but I mean, shifting, uh, shifting sands in the region. Do you think relations with the North may change? Um, it's unclear at the moment what effect former President Gun Hae's impeachment will have on the territories. Unfortunately, discontent in South Korea is not only related to President Gun Hae's administration. <laughs> okay. This is a major embarrassment uh, for South Korea. After a bird scared a California weatherman, we decided to pull a little prank on Lisa during Denver 7 at 6 a.m. Ah, what should I do? Oh. Well, he's got you. Come back. Kiss him. Oh. 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 <laughs> <laughs> this is good stuff. I was wondering why uh, Kirsten, our producer, is like, just stay on the screen after. Now it makes sense. Now you know. Trying to mess with gonna you. eat you. Well, there, and he's gone. <laughs> Crawled out from under the table right during the air. <laughs> Monica Adams dogs steal the morning news spotlight. Two. Watch out for a lift. Oh, okay. Hey. Stop. Let's try it again. In three. To watch out! Watch out for a little light fall. Reporter can't stop laughing after Cat interrupts new segment. Agora meu filho tá sujinho, viu? Ave Maria! Esse é preto, mas tá. Swedish reporter gets interrupted by screaming female. 
Här i Jerusalem så är idag mer än hälften av alla förskolebarn barn. I will never be able to look at another carrier bag again without hearing the sound it makes on contact. A long time to make change, even with the best one in the world. Fuck her right in the pussy. Irish news reporter Martina Fitzgerald gets interrupted by foul-mouthed youths. <laughs> Very funny. Fuck her right in the pussy. Oh, Martina. <laughs> Sky News correspondent Thomas Moore manages to keep his composure as a joker showers him with leaves in the middle of a live broadcast outside London's High Court. A weaker twin does die for any reason. I'm sorry about that. We do have some strange characters down here at the High Court. Um, but uh, if While reporting on a proposed speed reduction, the reporter is interrupted by an Asian schoolgirl. Reducing the speed limit from just 35 miles an hour to just 10. Fuck me right in the pussy. <laughs> what are you doing? Get we have some technical difficulties. This is the hilarious moment a toddler barged in her mother's study as she was being interviewed live on Sky News. Minister David Cameron was talking about. Oh, I'm really sorry, that's my son arriving. Sorry, I'm really embarrassed. Sorry. Hold on one second. Sorry. Um, yeah, you can have two biscuits. I'm really sorry about yeah, that. Yeah, okay, well, let's, we'll leave uh, Deborah Haynes in. News reporter slaps Guy for interrupting broadcast. <laughs> CBC reporter interrupted by Cat. Watch CBC Montreal reporter Alex Leduc try to get through recording his on camera promo while at the local SPCA. Four puppies. How much money the West Island SPCA says they need to stay open? How much money the West Island SPCA says they need to... Oh, bless you. Possible schizophrenia. Possible MK Ultra breakdown symptoms. Possible reptilian mental breakdown. Possible. Of course, just a crazy lady. But the possibilities hides the right door. It could be about time for another one. The decision... Oh, excuse me, I'm sorry, I'm online. That decision will be made at 10. We're live in Columbus Circle. Fix 11 News. Definitely odd. You see a lot of odd things uh, on live TV. Bill Steffen has been reporting from home. On April 27, 2020, his cats were the star of the show. Mizzou. The rain's pretty much over. Storm Track Live still showing just a few sprinkles of rain off to the south and southeast of Grand Rapids. A little moving system comes right across the state of Michigan, and that system could bring us about an inch of rain uh, through the mid part of the week. Not a bad day coming up for you tomorrow. It will be mild. Temperatures are going to be up in the uh, mid 60s to around 70 tomorrow afternoon. Warm day. Global News reporter Rob Leth heads out in the middle of winter to do a routine stand up for his broadcast in the snow. But what started as a good idea, an inner tube toboggan race, turns quickly sour when Leth is hit head on by one of the racers. All right, so I've got my trusty stopwatch, and here they come down the hill. It looks like Ruben is in the lead, and here comes out. Oh, that was a bad idea. At Riverside Park, Rob Leth, Global News. Reporter Walter Morris was caught breaking out his epic dance moves to whip Nene during a Fox 5 San Diego commercial break. These awkward Freudian slip-ups are our new favorite kind of news bloopers. Some cringe-worthy gold in these. Por mucho, mucho calor, temperaturas muy cálidas. Y para nuestra playa de Cancún, Quintana Roo, mínima de 25 grados, alcanzando como máxima lo totalmente despejado. Así que si va a viajar con su familia, ya sabe que en Cancún las condiciones están perfectas. Para Puerto Vallarta, en Jalisco, mínima de 24 grados, malos 31. También se nos presenta mucho calor, temperatura muy cálida, despejado. Y para Cabo San Lucas, 
en Baja California, mínima de 25 grados, alcanzando como máxima los 32. So if you are seeing this video and you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel and turn on post notifications.